Hi everyone, Novice Shooter here with another product review. Um, this time it's a request. Thank you, Luis, requested the belly band holster review. I did do one some time ago, but I guess it didn't make it onto this channel. I'm not exactly sure what happened to it. So let's take a look at the belly band holster. All right, so it mine arrived in a package like this, very straightforward plastic bag. Uh, nothing else, no instructions, no brand or anything. I, I'm not sure why. Um, when you open up the belly band holster, it opens up to about 42 inches long. The length is about 42 inches, and there's a little bit of give in it. So um, the give is about three inches. So I would say this could expand to a total of 45 inches. Let's take a look. Oh, by the way, um, that is not to talk about the size of the waist that this fits, because I'm going to show you on my waist, which is 34. Um, it basically fits me perfectly, uh, and it could certainly fit smaller waists, and it might fit someone who's slightly larger, but if you have a 40-inch waist, this product is probably not going to work for you. All right, so let's take a look at the quality of it. We'll take a look at the inside first, the part that goes against your skin, very important part. Uh, this is neoprene. Neoprene is the material that wetsuits are made out of. So if you've ever touched a wetsuit and you feel it, it's soft, it's smooth, it's, it's got a certain quality to it and the texture, that's what this is. Extremely comfortable, and as you can imagine, um, deals with water well and then there's this patch of velcro but it's not really velcro because it has a much lower profile than velcro you can barely see it um but it and when you rub it it feels real it feels relatively smooth i mean it's it's rough it's velcro like material and so it latches onto the back or what we would call the the outside of this belt and it holds it holds pretty well okay so that holds pretty well especially with resistance in the direction against the hooks let's take a look over here so with the velcro um how much material can this velcro attach to um about 28 inches worth and that's significant for a wide range of um waist sizes but we know as guys, it's kind of hard to have a waist that's below 30 inches if you're an old guy like me. Um, and if your waistband, again, is probably more than 40 inches, don't bother. Okay, it's not gonna fit you. Let's take a look at some of the other properties of this belt. Um, as I said, 28 inches of the outside is made for the Velcro to latch onto. In fact, that whole side is soft that way, which is nice. Uh, it does come with a safety latch. The, the snap is pretty good. I got to give it props on the snap. So let's see how a full size gun fits in. If you've watched my channel, you know that what I have is a, uh, a full size XD9 with a four inch barrel. And you can see that that goes in pretty well. But that brings me to the next part of the discussion here. Okay, which is um, on the underside of the belt here. Let's so let's take a look. You can see my four-inch barrel protru um, protruding pretty well out of this side. There's another place for a slightly narrower barrel, uh, and then on this side there's another whole section. So can it hold a larger gun? I'm, yes, I'm sure it can. But what you'll probably have to do is you'll probably have to clip these stitches here. So there are stitches here, and there are also stitches here just on this side of the barrel. Uh, I like this because as it is right now, it, it helps hold the gun in place. Uh, but if you have a gun with a wider barrel, or if for some reason you're struggling with getting your personal gun in there, um, you can see that this this holds pretty well. The snap is good. The safety snap is good. And uh, 
it doesn't come out. I'm pretty much jogging it around a lot. Uh, well, let's take a look at uh, what this is. Now, if you're carrying, you're probably carrying with a full mag, and that's going to add weight to it. And so I'm going to put a full magazine in here, and I'm not ratcheting it, so don't worry about that. But let's see, that makes it you know, significantly heavier. And how does it do with a full magazine? It's really shaking it around. That's pretty good. I think you could run for a while without this coming out. So it's pretty secure. I, I, I give it props. It's a very secure holster. Now where you can see when I put it on, there's, there's a little bit of overlap here, you know, four inches of overlap. So my waist is good for this. Uh, a woman's waist that's not larger than mine is good for this. And you can see if you're carrying it at three o'clock, if you're carrying it at four o'clock, uh, let's see how the Velcro holds if I jump up and down. Pretty good, a shake, pretty good. If I'm in a scuffle with somebody, that's a little bit different. Um, and if you're gonna wear this inside your waistband, which it will be comfortable, but you're gonna need a slightly larger waistband. So how about pulling the gun? Well, let's take a look at it. And you can see that the snap comes off and the gun comes out pretty quickly. Depending on how accessible it is to you. Now, for me, obviously, it's it's right out in front, um, and I don't want to do that too much with the magazine in. So, take the magazine out. Sorry, and uh, you can see it's empty. Nothing in the chamber, and I pulled the magazine out. All right. So, um, obviously, if this is inside of your shirt. That's a little bit different. Now, this is the only issue that I have found with it is I pulled my gun out, but now putting it back is, you know, a slightly larger challenge. But, you know, I wouldn't worry about that because if you end up pulling it, if you pull it out, you're probably going to need it. <laughs> and I'm putting it back. Who cares? You take your time. All right. So uh, there it is under my shirt. Let's take a look at the profile. Uh, in a t-shirt, you can clearly see that I'm carrying, all right? The, it clearly stands out. But if I were to throw a sweater on over it, which I happen to have, take a look at what happens to the profile if I throw a sweater on. Hey, wait a minute. Is it visible? Kind of, um, but I don't think people are gonna freak out. Like they're not gonna say, oh, that guy's carrying, it's, it, it's pretty well hidden, but again, it's hard to hide the full-size gun, especially in that position, which is the, um, right now it's the three o'clock position. If I move it to the four o'clock position, how does that look, okay? Can you see the profile under the sweater? I think you can, and so that is something to consider. And again, if you want to pull it out and it's under your clothes, same thing. You pull the snap and you get the gun out. Um, for me, this gun, because of what we just saw, the sight profile, it, it tends to get caught. Um, I would not conceal carry this gun. I might carry it, but um, because of the sight profile, it snags on my clothes every time I try the quick draw, uh, especially from a, an in the waistband holster. Okay, so um, I think that's a pretty thorough review. Again, uh, if you like this video, please like, share, subscribe to my channel, uh, and let me know your thoughts. Please feel free to, to speak to me, write comments. I respond to everyone. And again, this is the um, belly band holster, 42 inches round, uh, and it, it fits a 34 inch waist pretty comfortably. But again, if you are a larger man with a larger waist, you might uh, really consider whether or not this is the right product for you. Okay, so once again, it's Novice Shooter. Thank you for watching and I'll see you on the range.